Well, a pretty good barometer of the economy is Hammerson. It owns some of the UK's biggest shopping centres, including the Bull Ring in Birmingham, Brent Cross in London and High Cross in Leicester. Today, it reported a 6% rise in half-year profits to £113 million. And the chief executive, David Atkins, joins me now. So, David, headline retail sales in your UK centres were down 3.9%. Is that proof that shoppers are drawing in their horns? Well, I don't think... It tells you the complete picture because in this omni-channel world clearly some sales are going online we're often charging some of that online sales we're an advertising medium in itself so some of those figures I think are misleading we think under the physical store sales are understated by about 17 percent what I can tell you is that the retailers are becoming increasingly polarized in that omni-channel world on the very best centers where they want to offer their full range and experience so we saw record leasing activity in our portfolio right across the business up 44 percent yeah. in the half year so whilst the figures are a little bit soft from a sales perspective in our world retailers increasingly polarized on the very best locations what about France? You've got a lot of assets over there. Are you seeing a Macron effect yet, or is it too early? Uh, a little bit early. I mean, that's been a difficult market as well, but there's certainly some cause for optimism there. Consumer confidence is about a four-year high. We're not quite seeing it yet in the retail sales figures, but as we move through the year, I'm expecting France almost to sort of swap places a little bit with the UK in terms of, you know, they're reaching political uncertainty. We've still got our issues, and economically they're beginning to come through the worst of it. So that's looking a little bit more positive. And David, briefly, also in Dundrum, which is Ireland's largest retail centre. How is the Irish economy these days? Still motoring. Highest performing GDP growth in Europe, over 3%. Glad to say the Irish is still spending and we're seeing very encouraging demand for space again there. So that a definite bright spot for us in our, in our portfolio. All right, David Atkins from Hammerson. Good to see you. Thank you for joining me.